I see you, a Vienna von Braun, a man whose allegiance is ruled by expedience. Call him a Nazi, he won't even frown. Nazi schmatzi, says Vienna von Braun. Don't say that he's hypocritical, say rather that he's apolitical. Once the rockets go up, who cares where they come down? That's not my department, says Van von Braun. Some have harsh words for this man of renown, but some think our attitude should be one or other gratitude, like the widows and cripples in old London town who owe their large pensions to Van von Braun. You too may be a big hero, once you've learned to count backwards to zero. In German or to English, I know how to count down, and I'm learning Chinese, says Van von Braun. Launched explorer to the great beyond. He tried to alleviate when it started to deviate. We had to catch up to those commies somehow. It's a good thing we had lots of Werner von Brahms. While a paperclip was our depravity, what's worse is they lied about gravity. But Von Brown didn't frown and said, This rings a bell. Now go fetch me more Germans and do it, Max Schnell. Now, at the end of his days, with more time to reflect, he chose to disclose some notions verboten. They planned to deceive us with make believe threats and the Cold War was nothing compared to what's next. And after the Russians, it's the terrorists. And then third world countries will be scariest. And soon asteroids become the new enemy. And the best part will be the fake war with E.T. Assess, took from old Berlin town. They fed us with platitudes as they pillaged each latitude. And Galen told Alan, I've got this one down. We tales and the commies just won't come around. <laughs> so they pretend we're always at war. That will be nuked like Saddam and Gomorrah. They did it back then, and they'll do it today. Why do you think that they killed JFK? Now if you're frowned by the CIA, don't be alarmed. Just plan your allegiance as they force you into obedience. They'll boil you a bit and pretend that you'll drown, and they'll still get away with it. Cause you are brown And some might suggest it's quite comical To claim that it's all just economical Once they get what they want Who cares what you say Just as long as you say it To the old CIA Now they tried to kill Castro a few hundred times, their coups were quite sinister. Just ask the Iranian Prime Minister and poor Guatemala. How dare you decide to elect your own government? Oh look, your president, he died. Dare I say it's rather rude to stand up for united fruit. They'll just call you commies, and who cares if you're not? Oh, and in Cambodia they helped some dude named Pol Pot. In 
sincere they are, they stage a quick coup d'etat. They try to disarm Indonesia's Sukarno and Congo's Lumbumba. They shot in the face and they forced out Allende for Opino shame. They even helped the Dalai Lama and they ousted Nkrumah in Ghana. And Gular went Fubar and probably was killed, but they won't share the files from that coup in Brazil. They watched Papa Doc and his sweet little babe as they plundered their nation, another CIA creation. And they crewed Vietnam and then still wanted more. So they faked the Gulf of Tonkin to get a new war. The history books are still murky about what happened in Poland and Turkey. And Oliver North, surely he told the truth, but I guess we won't know cause he shredded the proof. Armed the Muja, hidden to the teeth, yet they still try to hide. They created Al Qaeda, and ISIS is simply just more of the same. If you still keep on buying it, you're just insane. Does the fact that it's all still quite classified make you the slightest dissatisfied? Like poor Chavez, so they gave him a cancerous blight. And Jack Ruby was screwed, even though he was right that they're infecting us with apathetic delight. While the mockingbird sings sweetly, so long, good night.